We got a uh, couple 911 calls from motorists on the turnpike uh, into the sheriff's office reporting that there was an individual pointing a gun at a highway patrol trooper on the turnpike. Uh, we're able to make contact with uh, the radio room for the highway patrol in Berea. Uh, we were able to confirm that that in fact had occurred. The trooper indicated that the individual had pointed the gun at him and had fled on foot. Uh, so we obviously began a uh, search of the area attempting to locate the individual. Had uh, canine units both from the Huron County Sheriff's Office and from the North Ridgeville Police Department. We also had assistance from Lorraine County Sheriff's Office, uh, Huron County Sheriff's Office with deputies. Started canvassing the area, uh, several state patrol troopers. We then got a uh, complaint from a citizen that an individual matched the description of the person we were looking for was walking on State Route 60 near Darrow Road. Uh, several units responded uh, to that area, and as those units pulled up, uh, they observed this male uh, matching the description of the individual from the turnpike. Uh, highway Patrol trooper made initial contact with him. Uh, the individual suddenly reached for his waistband, pulled out a long-barreled revolver, which is identical to the description given by the trooper on the turnpike, and took off running into this wooded area behind us here. Uh, other units responded. We gave chase. Uh, we had North Ridgeville's canine with us. Um, he tracked the individual back into the wooded area. Uh, there was a gunshot heard by a couple of the officers um, as the chase uh, continued, as the track continued, and we have found the male deceased in this wooded area uh, behind us here. Um, any, uh, what, what can you tell us? What was the... We don't know. We have no idea at this point. Uh, you know, obviously we know that we had a, a very dangerous individual pointing a weapon at a highway patrol trooper that needed to be um, taken into custody as soon as possible. What sort of weapon was it? Uh, it was a long-barreled revolver. Um, we'll get the make and model after we have a, uh, an opportunity to examine it further. Uh, any, uh, any? No, nobody's hurt. Um, he is, uh, the victim is uh, being taken to the funeral home in Vermillion at this point, and he will be autopsied uh, per the Erie County coroner. Uh, we have a name at this point. I'm not going to release that yet. Uh, Obviously, next of kin have not yet been, been uh, notified. So. And then pulled a weapon on law enforcement twice? Yes. Yeah, he pulled, uh, pulled a weapon on law enforcement, the uh, highway patrol trooper on the turnpike is our understanding here. That's what initiated this. And then as the officers arrived on Route 60 in an attempt to take him into custody, apparently there was another display of that firearm at that point as well.